You can model the problem in the solve it with two linear equations. Two or more linear equations form a system of linear equations. Any ordered pair that makes all of the equations in a system true is a solution of a system of linear equations. Here's an example. Note the two lines graphed. Uh, y equals 2x minus 3, the equation uh, to represent one of those lines, and y equals x minus 1. Together, they make a system of linear equations. The solution of this particular system of linear equations is the point 2, 1, because it's a point that is a solution of both of the equations. Problem 1, solving a system of equations by graphing. What is the solution of the system? Use a graph. Here we're given two equations, both in slope-intercept form, which will make the graphing easier for us. The first is y equals x plus 2. The second, y equals 3x minus 2. So we'll graph both equations in the same coordinate plane. First, y equals x plus 2. We can identify the slope as being 1, and the y-intercept is 2, and graph that as shown at the right, the orange line. Second, y equals 3x minus 2 has a slope of 3 and a y-intercept of negative 2, so we can graph it, as shown at the right, the blue line. Next, we want to find the point of intersection because that is the solution of the system. The lines appear to intersect at the point 2, 4. So we'll check to see if the point 2, 4 makes both equations true. So we substitute in 2 for x, 4 for y, and the equation on the left, 4 equals, we're questioning whether or not this is true, 4 equals 2 plus 2. That is true. On the right hand side, 4 equals, questioning, 3 times 2 minus 2, and sure enough, that's true as well. So we've checked our solution in both equations algebraically. It checks out, and so we can state with confidence the solution of the system is the point 2, 4. Your turn. What is the solution of the system? Use a graph. 